I do like it. I like it a lot. It makes you feel good. Yeah, that's sort of like easy. It's yeah. Kind of rocky. Simple. Yeah, I like it. No, it's, it suits the way I feel. <laughs> I have one look. I am wearing little itty bitty orange shorts. They're really tiny, and I'm wearing kind of a long sleeve thermal brown tie dye get up sort of thing with another orange scarf with little tassels and mirrors, and a and I think I'm wearing a purse as well that has fringe and it's very poochy. You'll be the only one to butter me up. Milan's going well. It's um it's different than last season. It's my second season, but it's it's going well. Um, Booking some good shows. I'm doing um, doing this. Uh, I did the uh, hair and makeup test for Roberto Cavalli today, which I didn't do last season, so that's good. Um, some other stuff. Iceberg, Ante Prima. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Can't think. You know, shows. <laughs> Summer was good. It was it was hot, really really hot. I was in New York, but it was, it was good. I didn't really do anything that exciting, but <laughs> we worked. It was still fun. Um, no, I kind of was on a little bit of a. Well, I worked a little bit, but it was you know summer's a little slow, so I didn't do, I didn't do that much over summer. But I still I still had a good summer. I uh, you know hung out with my friends. Did, you know. The usual summer stuff. <laughs> How's your apartment furnished? I was sort of curious. Furnished? Um, it is. Well, right now it's kind of in a transition period. I um, right now it's kind of it's a little bit funky. I have a lot of my dad's art on the walls. I have. Um, I like furniture that's like painted and then kind of roughed up. Um, I just finally got a mattress. I was sleeping on a little day bed for so long and it was so miserable. So I got like a big nice mattress in the middle of my apartment. Um, but yeah, it's just, I like collecting, I like, uh, you know, like antique stores. Like I love little trinkets and kind of, can I love candles and just like weird little, little trinkets. I'm really into finding little boxes, like little gold boxes and other little weird things. and. I like I like having that all displayed, old photographs and kind of stuff like that. So it's kind of I don't know. My mom would describe it as shabby chic, but I don't know if that's how I would describe my apartment. But I kind of want to take some stuff out. I want to. It's a little bit cluttered in there. I want to go a little more minimal. Minimal. My dad's an artist. He um he's a graphic illustrator. He's he's really incredible. He um, did a lot of stuff I got in the 60s and 70s with like um, like the Beatles and the Rolling Stones and Jimi Hendrix and Led Zeppelin and Pink Floyd and what's your dad's name? Alan Aldridge. He did. Are you joking? I yeah. I mean, I knew him. Really? Like the 60s. Yeah, yeah. That's my dad. <laughs> He's awesome. Hey, Dad. <laughs> Love you. I miss you. <laughs> Question why she needs to be so free. I know I'm not a very good painter, but you know, there's other things that I like to do that are sort of creative. <laughs> but um, yeah, no, I don't really have, I'm not really a good painter. I, I've tried, I, I'll get into like, I'll go to a museum or something and I'll see all the beautiful art and I'll get really inspired and I'll, I'll go out and buy like a paint set and like a big pad of paper and I'll be like all right I'm gonna start painting like every day and I'll like try and paint something and it'll, it never turns out good and I'm such an impatient person it's such a bad quality and I'm like Ugh, I'm not good and I just give it up like right then and there it's like the same with that's like story of my life <laughs> Lucky charms that you carry around with you? Mm, no, I don't. I, I've had so many lucky charms, but I, I, I guess I guess the reason I have so much bad luck is because I'm losing all these lucky charms all the time. But um, yeah, I've had plenty, but none, none currently. I need to find one. That's a good idea. 
Thanks. I've been recently getting into music, or I love music, I've always loved music, but I, recently trying to pursue music more, I guess. Every, I mean, everyone says that they play guitar, but I like to think that, I, I mean, I'm, I can play like a teeny tiny bit of guitar, but I need to, I need to practice more and maybe I'll get a little better. But um, I've been hanging out with a lot of my friends in Brooklyn who are in bands and they've been really inspired by them and I, I've been trying to make music because they're always making music every day and it's so, so rad and I'm jealous and so I've been I've been trying to do that as well and I've been messing around on GarageBand and making weird stuff and recording vocals and really terrible guitar but maybe if I keep doing it if I keep at it maybe in like a year or something I'll be kind of good maybe I don't know probably not but it's really fun and I really like doing it so that's, that's cool <laughs> We did, we did, yeah, we jammed out at her place. We, um, she, was, she has a little drum set and she was playing drums, I was playing guitar. I'm not a good guitarist though, let me get that out there. She is much better than I am. But yeah, we, were, we, were, we tried recording a song. Um, it was really fun though, yeah, she's a, she's a great guitarist and, and her drum kit is really fun. And uh, yeah, we had, we had fun, it was cool. <laughs> Are you still interested in buying clothes? Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm trying I'm trying to find a really good vintage store in Paris while I'm here. I really I've been hearing about vintage stores and I really want to find a good one to to do uh to do some some damage. <laughs> but yeah, I mean I, I already have so many clothes here with me, like my bag is already overweight, so I'm kinda scared to buy anything else because I don't have to pay for the overweight. But we'll see. But I, I don't really sh you know, I don't go shopping that much. I uh I don't know. I, ha I have, sometimes I go shopping, I guess, but there's no particular store that I really shop at. I don't really buy designer things. Maybe one day when I have more money. <laughs> I'm wearing a really awesome outfit that I really like. It is high-waisted black and white checkered pants up to here and a little uh, black and white checkered crop top that goes over it. Uh, that's my first look and I really like it and I tried it on the fitting and he gave it to me because I loved it so much and so I'm really grateful for that. The second outfit is like a yellow, really bright yellow dress with all these flowers all over it and it's really short and it's very cute and it's fun, yeah, it's good, it's bright yellow, it's good. <laughs> and flats. All you need is for is the nerve of steel.